kwamba chuo kikuu cha Masinde Muliro kimetoa masharti mapya ya mavazi swala ambalo limezua mjadala mkali chuoni humo na mwanahabari wetu Zakes Mwasame yuko kule atujuze tu ni mabadiliko gani yaliyoidhinishwa na usimamizi wa chuo hicho Mwasame Sonata tupo hapa mbashara ile ya lango kula chuo kikuu cha Masinde Muliro kinajiita chuo cha sayansi na teknolojia hapa Kakamega hapo jana ilani nitoka kuhusu mavazi wanafunzi wale walikuwa wanavaa bikini wale wengine walikuwa wanafika darasani na mavazi ambayo hayapendezi msomizi wa chuo na hapo jana msomizi wa kitengo cha wanafunzi akatoa ilani hiyo haraka haraka upesi na jiunga na mmoja wa wanafunzi hapo chuo kikuu cha Masindi Muliro labda jina lako ni nani na ilani hiyo ilipokea kwa njia gani kwa niaba ya wanafunzi wengi ah mimi naitwa mimi naitwa Derek kama Fred uh, for actually i took it positively because at that time you see that there is some other has put by one of our students one of the students in the university that are shaming and the the main agenda of the university of higher education is that to to mold people so that they can go to the society and be the mentors to the children and they are molding the professional so professional set with the dressing code so that's why i took it positively because on my side we are molding each other that can interact in society positively and be the, be the mentor of the young children mimi nikuulize nini kilichochea wa muziki kama wewe kutolewa na chuo mimi what was the maybe what was the reason that made the university administration to take that kind of step i think maybe i the, i don't know the main reason but what on my side i think it's just like you see even even you if you meet somebody who has not dressed well sometimes i thought by human beings who are the lecturers so that one may give the uh, is a disruption to class i think so yes my kana kuna wengine walikuwa warembo na vaa kuanzia kuchochea wa adri ni ukweli i want to comment on that ah sante mtazungumza sante sana ndugu nashukuru sana acha nizungumze na hapa mzazi hapa mmoja wa wakazi wa hapa kama ndio ndugu utaanza kwa jina lako alafu utueleze labda umepata ujumbe huo kwa njia gani kama mzazi ah mimi kwa makina ninaitwa Jacob Juma Shamala nafanya hapa Kameka mzazi wa wanafunzi hapa Shomuro kwa okay NTC nina furaha tena kabisa kutokana na uamuzi wa management ya yes kutoa ilani ya mavazi ambayo sio faa ya hivi sana kupata watoto wetu wanatembea uji kwa tao ndio sulimbaya sana sisi kuacha watoto wanatembea nusu uji watoto wa mavazi ambayo haina heshima ni vizuri watoto wakisoma wanaelimika na tena wanavaa na wazazi wao inaenda sambamba na elimu yao si wanavaa vitu ambavyo inapotosha hata kali ya yetu inapotea tumeika mtindo wa wazungu watoto wanavaa vitu fupi hata vile wewe una aibika na huko mtoto wako unashindwa kumsalamia kwa hivyo mimi nataka kutoa shukrani kubwa kwa management ya Masimbemuri University kuleta ilani ile ilani ile watoto wetu waweze kuvaa vyema waweze kuvaa kwa wasitolea aibu wanapotembea katika mji wetu huu wa Kamega ah asante sana nashukuru sana labda unadhania huu mfano wa musti nafaa kuchukuliwa na vile vile ningelipenda sana eh, watu vile vyote Kakamega MTC ya Kenya University a uh, Kaipianga, Kipadi, Nairobi wote waje waike mtindo wa kameka wa, wa, wa must kwa sababu ni mtindo mzuri sana watu wetu wa kilewa hivi tutakuwa tunalea watu wazuri na matundu yetu tutaendelea asante sana nashukuru sana mimi na kutakia kile na heri ah ah kuna mgavi hawa nafuzi sisi kama watu wazungumza habari zenu mna wala pizza tu wala wala pizza na lasanya hawa ni kama wala kile walicheka kando hapo so sita hapo ni kama hayo wengi wanasema wanataka hawataki kusema sana afuse ndio kina dada wanasema huo uamuzi hawatatoa maoni yao kwa sasa sijui wanataka kufanya Uh, kwa kiingereza naita petition au namna gani lakini hivyo ndivyo hali hivyo kwa hiyo tutakuwa tunaangalia hili swala hili ili tutaleta uh, taarifa kutendeti katika taarifa zetu hapo baadaye mimi ni Zakia Simasame kwa hiyo sasa sana Zakia